good morning students uh, today we are going to see a simple program an assembly level language program assembly language program for the addition of two 8 bit numbers so and introduction to the uh, machine tesson and emulator 8086 these are the two softwares in which we can run our assembly language program so we will see later the introduction of the machine tesson and emulator 8086 first of all we uh, learn or uh, how to write a uh, assembly level language program uh, and how to run in how to run it in machine tesson by using machine tesson and the same in uh, emulator 8086 so first of all uh, we write a program in assembly level language for the addition of two 8 bit numbers so just uh, we have to write down a program in a simple a notepad that is a text file we have to create okay so first of all open notepad and just we have to write down a program in that so start a uh, <clears throat> assembly level language program in masm tesson actually contains the two blocks mainly well, first one is the data uh, segment block or we can call it as a data block and second one is the code block code segment that is so in data segment block we take the two values first of all n1 db 01h and n2 db suppose 04h okay and then data ends so what is that actually this is the data block and this contains the two numbers that is uh, <coughs> first number is 1 so 01 is uh, it's is in hexadecimal form so it's in right and uh, 404 is means 4 in decimal so it is in hexadecimal db as we seen earlier or we Uh, db dw are the simple data types or what we can say that as these are the directives preprocessor directives uh, which tell the program uh, how to uh, store the memory okay so means db means define bytes we have seen earlier so for first number that is suppose we take a variable n1 and n2 so it stores uh, in memory for n1 uh, how many bytes 8 bytes okay so sorry one byte eight defined byte means one byte it is stored eight bits okay then we will better we have here uh, separation of the two segments the code segment then assume cs as your code segment and comma Uh, ds as your data and then start this is the label how we write label in this way we put the colon in front of that then actual starting here code starts move x comma data and move uh, ds comma ax so what is that these two lines indicate the initialization of the ds register that is the data segment register okay so next move al comma n1 what is that n1 is the variable in which we have taken our first number so we move that number to the register al that is the 8 bit register that is the lower 8 bits of the uh register ax okay then we take our second number n2 in the bl register and then what uh, as we seen earlier the what is the instruction for the addition of the two numbers is just add right so by taking that add al comma bl we have performed here the simple addition okay so that's the instruction in 8086 uh, 
for addition of two numbers. So A and B are the two operands. Okay. So we will see later by running after running the program, we will get to know that. Then what we have to do, we are separate here, so we can get easily understand. Add A L comma 30H. What is that? Actually, it converts the result stored in AL register to the ASCII. Uh, it converts actually to the ASCII from BCD. Okay, so it converts the ASCII from BCD, right? The output actually. And then we have to take our output in AL. <coughs> so, uh, what we have done here, we have taken the our output in AL. Okay, so we just have moved it to the DL register for printing just. And then, uh, let's separate here again, move AH comma 0 to H. Okay, and then int 21H. So what is that? Actually again, these are the... Mm, what we can say instructions so int is the interrupt okay interrupt that is the having name 21 yet that is the working as a main function and move h comma 0 to h we can say that it's a sub function under the main function in 21 h and what's the use of that as we see in the lecture that uh, move h comma 0 to h means we are moving the decimal number 2 to the register ah that is the higher 8 bits of the ax register so by doing that the system get to know that we have to print something and what that something is the content of the DL register it simply prints. So we have taken here move AL comma DL means we have taken the output of our program in the DL register and just because of these two lines it gets printed. Okay and then we have to take sorry. 21h better to separate and then move a h comma 4 c h and again int 21h so what's that move h comma 4 c h actually so again it's the first sub function of the main function in 21h and it returns to the screen okay suppose it works like a get ch we have in our c programming you have seen that so just like that it uh, works and then code ends and end star okay so that's it our program we have done with our program so just go to file and first of all we will save it suppose we have saved it in the desktop on the desktop by file name suppose add 8 okay or just simply addition okay and we have to save it by using the dot asm asm is for assembler its extension and just save okay. our program is get got saved on the desktop so we minimize it here is our program right if we double click on it but its extension is dot asm now it's ready to run in the masmtsm so how to run it in the Masson we will see in next lecture. Thank you.